Hey everyone, Jalance here, and today we are down in Fort Walton Beach, Florida. Yes, the beach is just right there. But really quick, I want to thank sponsor today's video being Surfshark VPN. Yes, Surfshark VPN, keeping you safe on the internet as it has been keeping me safe through all my travels. So VPN stands for Virtual Private Network. Essentially, it helps to anonymize your data. Yes, it helps to keep your data safe and private. And that's especially when you're using those public Wi-Fi networks. I use them all the time, such as I was using them here, I was using them over there, I'm using them everywhere. And besides instilling confidence that my data will not be stolen, you can also use it to change your geography, so you can watch different TV shows, you can get uh, different sales and deals if you're doing online shopping. So for example, if you live somewhere where you can't access Disney+, Plus, use Surfshark, you will now be able to. What's really cool is it is unlimited devices, so you can share with your family and your friends and or use it on your different phones, on your computer like I do. They also do have a 30-day money-back guarantee. Yes, 30-day money-back guarantee, so you really have nothing to lose. So click that link down below, guys. Use that code on screen at Joel H. It's going to get 83% off and three months free. Sweet deal, so definitely act now. And at that, keep your data safe on the internet, protect your data, and let's get to the rest of the video. Hey everyone, Joel Hanson here, and today we're back in Memphis, Tennessee. Yes, Memphis, Tennessee. Last time I was here, I was walking in Memphis with my feet 10 feet off a beal, and now I'm gonna be walking with my stomach about 10 inches off the ground after this challenge. Here are my good friend, Mr. Brett Healy. Brett Healy, if you're not familiar, a local Memphis eater. And we're here at Wally Hatchets, just Wally Hatchets, to do their triple bypass burger challenge. Basically, this is a big burger um, loaded with bun, beef, half pound patties, and there's like, I think bacon, cheese, jalapeno poppers, and there's grilled cheeses. Uh, and then you have like more layers. So each layer is like a grilled cheese, jalapeno poppers, fried pickles, all the above. Um, we are gonna have 20 minutes to complete it. We do we get the meal for free, which is pretty sweet. Mr. Brett. Ready to eat some food? I'm ready, man. Shut up and eat. Hey, well, there you go. <laughs> so that's something I should probably learn to do. I talk a lot. But anyway, let's head on in. Let's see what we do. Let's have some fun. And uh, that's about it. If we fail, it's going to be 25 bucks. And I think the current record is about 15 minutes. 1547, I think. 1547. But I was counting the seconds. There you go. 1547, <laughs> 20 minute time limit. Let's head on in. See what we can do. All right, so here I am with the challenge itself. So it looks really good. Um, so my correction, I guess the record is somewhere about like seven and a half minutes. Yeah, like you said, burgers. Uh, lots of cheese, Texas toast, um, bacon, all of the shebang, and this is their seasoned fries. So it looks really good, so 20 minutes. Mr. Bryant, ready? I'm ready, man. Let's do it. So let's get eaten. Save the count of five, four. Oh, and thank you for Brett. We actually have a timer today, so I can I give you an accurate whatever. So three, two, one, let's uh let's eat. Let's eat. Good luck, Brett. Cheers. Good burger. Mm -hmm. You just can talk and stuff too, you don't need to really fire. <laughs> Oh yeah, definitely a hot one down here at the bottom. Yeah, you can give us your commentary. We have Gina, an official, official announcer today. I looked away for two seconds and like half the sandwiches are gone. <clears throat> How was the pack? Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we're here at Wally Hatchets in Memphis, Tennessee. Good to be back in the land of the Delta Blues. Here doing the Triple Bypass Burger Challenge. So, pretty straightforward burger challenge and let's get into the details about it. Definitely a hot one. Still hot. Very, very hot. But it's tasty. So you have what I would kind of essentially classify as like kind of three burgers stacked on top of each other um, with Texas toast in there uh, as like grilled cheeses. Um, again, we have bacon, you have a number of different cheeses. Of course, you have the patties themselves. We had jalapeno poppers. Um, we had quite a few different things. And then you have an order of fries. Um, you do have 20 minutes to complete it. Otherwise, you're looking at a $25 price tag. Try the fries. I found the jalapeno popper on the on the bottom side. It's a little bit of a surprise, but really tasty. <laughs> Your eyes are watering. <laughs> Where is it? And you also got a sweet t-shirt for completing this challenge. Um, but yeah, pretty straightforward in that regard. I mean, again, 
um, just a burger and fries challenge. Of course, I have my pile of ketchup, not only for my flavor preference, but also using it as a tool to add some lubricity. Uh, this was a challenge Brett was aware of and told me of in the area, so I'm really glad we got to swing on by and do this one. Um, as far as strategy, well, hey, let's uh, let's talk about strategy of this one. It's like a surprise, like a Kinder surprise. Just open yeah. it up. <laughs> So for the strategy of this challenge, I was going to eat the meat first and then kind of move on to the buns and the fries, which at this point I had the meat down. So then I was just going into the fries and the buns. Um, and then from there, that should kind of bring us to the end of it. Uh, Brett had a very similar style, although he was eating his burgers slightly more as burgers. So we're just over here by like 3, 20 a.m. I don't know why. Brett's killing it. He's basically, we're both like done the burger more or less. Uh, so let's continue to crush this. And when I say eating them more like burgers, I meant he was eating kind of his buns and meat together. I myself find it's easier to eat one item at a time for a lot of things. I find only having the one texture um, or the one kind of food at a time can make things a lot easier. Um, there are some exceptions, but when it comes to this, I'd rather eat the fries by themselves, rather eat the meat by themselves, rather eat the buns by themselves. You get the picture. Um, so yeah, basically just heading on in. That, that's pretty much all the info I kind of have for you today. Um, the food tasted good. Um, this definitely is a little busy spot. It's kind of like a brunch spot with earlier hours. Um, but that, I think that's a about it. So I'll let you get to the rest of the video. Hope you enjoy and ultimately let's see if we can complete this challenge. <coughs> yeah, there's a healthy department. Oh, Keep it up, my brother. You're doing really well. And I think Brett's going to come in well, 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 well under the time limit here. So keep it up, man. Let's get going. What's that? I think my local challenge has some work. I'm not sure if my pit will be in this. Probably good. I once, I once went against a very large dog. A very large dog can eat quick. <laughs> Thank you, appreciate it. Ketchup is key. I like it. It's, it's preference, but it's it is a tool as well. So. Doing good, bro. You got it. It's a moist, little sweaty. Yeah, he heating up a little bit. Thank <laughs> you. 
Gotta give appreciation where appreciation is due, right? Also, while I'm at it, shout out to Dying Animal Shirts, go check out jellies.com. There you go, there's my plug. Alright, and here we go. Brent is just down to the last small, small, small morsel. Definitely leaving no doubt. Shout out leaving no doubt. There you go. And he was crushing guys. Seconds. Absolutely right. crushed it, my dude. Joel, yeah, you crushed it, man. Holy moly, that was fantastic. One thing I love about Joel's technique, he can keep fast as lightning, but you do it so casually, like it's just you know, another walk in the park. I love it. I love it. It's like, oh, good style. <laughs> just, just, you just, you just got to do what you got to do. But I do want to want to thank, uh, give a huge thanks to Wally Hatchets here in Memphis. Really cool place. We can show to everybody who came out to watch. Thank you so much, everybody. Yeah, really appreciate it. Your was awesome. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you. We even had uh, individuals coming from two hours away on such short notice. So thank you so much for doing that. Um, but that's about it. So we get the meals for free, which is pretty cool. Twenty-five dollars meals for free. Um, Good burger. It was, yeah. it was good. The fries were like seasoned, so if you want a good burger, definitely would recommend. Did you, you like... get a taste of it, uh, something sweet in your burger, or no? Was that just me? I got like a couple sweet bites that took me by surprise. I enjoyed it, but it was a little some, unexpected. I definitely got some like, I definitely like the jalapeno popper. Yeah. Um, you know, there was, maybe like, it was the cream some, some fried pickles. Yeah, maybe yeah. cream cheese, some a little sweet. Uh, but yeah, it was good. No complaints. Uh, like I said, if you want to come on by, grab some of the burger, would recommend. They are known for their burgers. It is like kind of a more brunch place. They're only open yeah. like eight to two most days, uh, maybe all days. But yeah. Anybody? Till next time. Of course, I don't recommend eating this much food, but nonetheless, stay happy all the other happy eating. Brett, any final words? Uh, no, this is a great challenge for you know just like casual, like non-pro eaters too. This is very doable. 20 minutes is a good time limit for it. As you said, you know, Joel definitely crushed it, but 20 minutes is quite realistic. The food was very, very tasty. I enjoyed it, so yeah, no complaints here. Awesome time. I like it. And in fact, like, like Brett said, this is definitely a good challenge for anybody who I guess wants to try a challenge or get into a challenge without overly committing, it's only 25 bucks. And uh, I think they've said they've actually had about almost or about 50% success rate. So just say, those are pretty good odds. Yeah. So everyone, until next time, to have other happy eating, I already said that. Just have a little day. And they say North, Meets South. Huge <laughs> thanks to Brett. Brett's, we're so funny. Brett's the genius behind this one, so <laughs> I like it. Yeah, there's a reason I don't write jokes or eat for a living. Burger. Hey, well, <laughs> not, none the, nonetheless. Yeah. Man, man that can make jokes and can eat. So, five, absolutely, five absolutely crushed it. Yeah, 10 out of 10 would recommend. Dang, now cat. You're gonna be down the menu next week if you don't shut up. So everybody, thanks so much for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed. Click my face right here to subscribe. And also, I picked two videos. That's right, two videos just for you that you might like. Right here. So like I said, guys, hit that subscribe. Hit one of these videos. Do it right now. Until next time, have a lovely day. <laughs>